using the nth term for an arithmetic sequence, this un equals a plus n minus 1d, it has many uses and is very useful in solving different types of problems that we're going to encounter. One of them could be looking like this. We have an arithmetic sequence um, and I have some of the terms at the start, 6, 7.2, 8.4, and it continues all the way up to 27.6. Now let's say we wanted to know how many terms there were in this sequence. How many? What is the value of n? And what I'm going to do is I'm going to use this formula in order to find that. So first of all, I'm going to need to identify what a and d are. So first of all, a is 6 and d is the common difference, what I'm adding on each time, and that's 1.2. So what I'm saying is that the nth term is that, so the last term can also be written in that same way. So 27.6 can be written as a plus n minus 1 times d. And I want to know what that value of n is. So that just breaks down to solving this equation. So all I've done is replace the un with 27.6, the last term in the sequence, to try and determine what term it is. So if I take 6 from both sides, I've got 21.6 is 1.2n minus 1. Now if I divide both sides by 1.2, so 21.6 divided by 1.2 is 18. So 18 is n minus 1, add 1 to both sides, so n is 19. So there were 19 terms in this sequence. And that's how I can solve this type of problem.